how you doing guys welcome as to the making of this video today is saturday june the 18th and right in front of you as you can see is my stash of inventory of armory that i have and the reason that i'm uh, putting all this together is i have to hide or temporarily put in storage of uh, most of them so that uh, my daughter and her grandma won't be able to see it they are gonna be in town for the summer and i don't really want them to you know see everything that i have and know uh what i have so i'm gonna have to hide them uh definitely the ammo cans they will be put into storage and then as far as in my goods here inside the cases they will be hidden but i'm gonna be able to get to it if need be in a hurry uh yes have instant access to them still uh but doing so i'm gonna have to prep up them so when i need them I still have uh, something to feed them without having these available since they're gonna be in storage. But uh, I'll sh be back and I'll show you how I prepped up my cases. All right, be back. All right, guys, here it is. This is my first case. This is the uh, Apache 4800 case that I uh, have. And here is my setup. There it is. Uh, I got my Glock 19 here, my Glock 26 here. And then, uh, of course, uh, earplugs. Always have it in your gear. But uh, my Keltec Sub 2000 here. But for storage, of course, uh, I have fully loaded magazines. Um, I got plenty of magazines in there. There's a probably about uh, uh, 10 magazines in there, uh, including, you know, for my Keltec, my two Glocks. So I got about uh, 10 magazines fully loaded. So that's all prepped up and ready for uh, just in case I need it. Uh, I have ammo with it. All right, all right, guys. Next up is my soft uh, rifle case. It's a double rifle case. Let's take a look. Hey, okay, here it is. That's my uh, Maverick 88 shotgun set up. It's ready to go. Uh, I got shells all in their uh, uh, holders and then right here is my CD 15 or AR 15 and then all the magazines in there including uh, the 22 conversion is already set up uh, fully loaded so that's all ready to go all right all right guys next up my uh, Norinco SKS There it is guys right there And over here is the extra ammo you see right there They're in the stripper clips ready to go and over here is actually more ammo but what I did was also utilize the uh, what do you call it the uh, the holder right here the shell holders what I did was put them in bundles of three and then using those uh, uh, small rubber band hair ties you could easily get from those dollar stores packs of I guess uh, over I know there's over a hundred or even 500 
of these uh, hair ties. Put them together, put them in there. And then they hold the shell well. See? So, some people ask why do I have shell holders on my, uh, a lot of my rifles, like the SKS. It's a simple reason to be able to hold shells. Just bundle them in threes like these and then just put them in. So I'll always have, uh, well not always, but I'll have uh, more extra ammo ready to go. All right. Here you go. All right, next up, another Plano hard case. This one right here is labeled pointer accuracy over and under. This is the 12 gauge shotgun double barrel. Let's take a look. All right, guys, there it is. We got all the shells right there. So when I need it, take it out, put the shells in, and then ready to go. All right. All right, guys, next up is my uh, Savage 64-22 long rifle. Let's take a look. There it is, my Savage 22 long rifle, Savage 64. Of course, some extra ammo, 22s easily load. There's the magazines. I got all the magazines fully loaded, ready to go. And then these right here, even though they look like uh, shot shells, they're containers for my 22 LRs. Uh, let's see. There and there. See them right there. So, I believe each one holds about uh, six to seven uh, 22 LR. So, those are extra in there. I put it with, you can see, that's a reason for these uh, shell holders. So I just put these shells in there and they hold extra 22s. All right, it's pretty simple, ready to go. All right guys, last one. It's uh, not really an actual uh, firearm uh that's in there let's take a look this is actually my uh, air gun right there and of course the rifle has the uh, uh shell holders to be able to put the shells in there and then the shell contains uh 22 uh, pellets so this is actually a 22 caliber pellet uh, pump pump gun and then I of course I got uh, another uh, pump action handgun and then another one right there I forgot the name of them but yeah so I'm also putting this away, even though it's not re a real firearm, it's just air guns, but still, they are guns. All right, guys. There it is. So I'm gonna put everything away. Clean my ammo. All All right, guys, there it is. Um, once again, thanks again for watching. And to note, as to the making of this video, today is June 18th on a Saturday. 
and I may not be able to make any guns and ammo video until mid-August. So just to let you know. All right. Thanks again for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Laters.